Welcome back to the High School Sports Zone. It's been just about three weeks now since the horrific shootings at Santa Fe High School that took the lives of 10 people, eight students and two adults. In the wake of that tragedy, a group of Santa Fe students have risen to the forefront and joined together to form Hearts United. And for more on Hearts United, we welcome in from Santa Fe High School, Annabelle O'Day and Caitlin Richards. Girls, thank mm -hmm. you very much for being with us. We appreciate it. Thank you for having us. As it's been three weeks, mm -hmm. uh, is there a sense of normalcy getting back to your routine and everything at Santa Fe High School in the wake of this horrible tragedy? It's a little bit, um, it's getting a little bit better, but there's days where you wake up and it just, it still doesn't feel like reality. You know, it's just so crazy. I went to orientation for college and it's everybody, you know, you ask, where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? And nobody knows how to respond. And it, it's painful. Yeah, it's a tough situation. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about Hearts United and mm -hmm. some good that's come out of this. First of all, how did the idea get started? So one night I couldn't sleep, you know, there were people were talking about they were expecting protests, you know, something to happen the next day. But we were, our community was there for each other. We weren't focused on politics or anything like that. But I came to my friends with an idea, Caitlin and two others, Maddie and Katie, and I was like, you know what, we need to do something. We need to do something that doesn't involve politics. It doesn't involve any of that anything that would create division because that's where we are right now. Um, there's a lot of people that are divided and we need something to create unity. And with Hearts United, that's something that can create unity. You know, everybody can get behind a movement of love and kindness. Yeah, Caitlin, uh, obviously you were on board right away. Yes, mm -hmm. absolutely. All right, so tell us the mission of Hearts United uh, because it's, it's all good. And what is the purpose? Mm -hmm. And so our mission right now is to create some support for the survivors. You know, it's going to be very tough going back to school in the fall. And so we want to create an event for the students that can kind of get them back into the normalcy, something where they can have some support and love from us, especially because, you know, us seniors won't be there for them. And um, yeah. Yeah. And then I understand long term you want to create awareness for mental health issues. Tell me about that. Mm -hmm. um, so we just believe that it's very important because mental health isn't really talked about a lot nowadays and we believe that it plays a huge role in people's lives whether they're depressed or they feel like they're being bullied or it's something going on in their life and they it's not widely accepted for people to talk about that. So it's better to talk about it and let people know that it's okay to hurt and feel these emotions so that you don't keep it bottled up. Yeah, mm -hmm. You girls have done a phenomenal job of getting the message across. Mm -hmm. You were at the Dynamo game, mm -hmm. and I know they've been very involved with what you're doing. Tell me about that experience, because I was there when you spoke to the crowd, and it was very moving. Um, yes, sir. So we've been very blessed for them to have opened us with, or welcomed us with open arms. Um, they, we came to them with an idea, and they've made everything happen, and everything's just so surreal, you know? Uh, just the events and everything that happened, but they have given us a platform for help, you know. So. Yeah, it was a tribute to Santa Fe Day at the mm -hmm. stadium. It was a beautiful event. And then you had a big event. I know it went great on Memorial mm -hmm. Day uh, at the park near Santa Fe High School. Uh, tell me about that. So me and Annabelle actually went up to the park around 8 a.m. that morning, um, even though the event didn't start till 3. And we just kind of set up everything, and people started coming in before we even really opened at 3. And it was just an inflow of all of the community being together, and it was really kind of a happy day. Great job. Mm -hmm. I understand you've raised already over $30,000. That's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Where do you go from here, and how can people help? Um, yes, sir. So we have created a Facebook page and a Twitter page, um, Hearts United. Just look it up. If you would like to donate, I don't know if you can donate on the Facebook page yet, but you can go to dynamocharities.org and click on the Give Now button, and you can just follow us because we've got some exciting things coming. All right. Well. I got to commend you girls and your friends for what you're doing. You're now Santa Fe alums. Yes, Yeah, sir. you're getting yes. old because you mm -hmm. just graduated. Mm -hmm. You're going to study chemical engineering at U of H. You're mm -hmm. going to study pre-med at Mary Harden Baylor. So mm -hmm. great futures ahead. And thanks for what you're doing for the community and for the school. Thank you so much. Thank you.